Hi, my name is Nagananda Kumar. I'm the executive director of the Myra School of Business. I'm here to talk to you about business school education and why I think you ought to consider Myra School of Business as the place to get it. Look, India produces 5 million graduates every year and Indian industry produces about 300,000 jobs. Now you do the math. 5 million graduates competing for 300,000 jobs. It's incredibly difficult out there. I understand it. And that's why business education has not only become desirable, but it's also necessary in order to qualify yourself to get one of those 300,000 jobs. That's it. Business school education, no matter what else they claim, if they can't help you get a job, is simply not worth the effort. If you want to improve your character, if you want to improve your personality, all those things are great. If a business school can help you do it, wonderful. But at the end of the day, they must get you job opportunities. We started just last year. We have 49 students in our PGDM class, Postgraduate Diploma in Management. That's what PGDM stands for. And this year, we placed all of them in internships in fabulous companies like Future Brands, Access Bank, Rediffusion, Unisys. These aren't companies that just pick anybody. They're choosy. They come to schools where they believe value, serious value is added to students. And that's what Myra School of Business has come to represent for many companies. Here's why. We get faculty from several countries in the world, the US primarily, then the UK, then France, and then Portugal. And now soon we're going to get faculty from uh, Singapore. My hope is to get faculty from countries such as Dubai, which are fast growing, or South Africa, the, the world is becoming global. Everybody talks about that. So if you want to be global in your mind, one way is to go abroad and learn, and the other is to have teachers from all over the world come and teach you. It's not that India does not produce great faculty, business school faculty, of course we do. But it's very important that we have foreign faculty come and teach in our schools so that we get a global experience sitting here right at home. Now, there are schools which do it. I'm not going to name them. You know it. If you don't know it, you should go to the internet and find out. But they cost you an arm and a leg. 32 lakhs, 22 lakhs. We bring you similar educational experience at 10 lakhs. Now, that's value for money. We have faculty who come and teach our, teach our students from places like King's College, University of Cambridge in the UK, the Catholica Business School in Lisbon, Portugal, and a whole slew of schools from the US, Cornell, uh, Arizona State, Michigan State. And these are not people who are just anybody. These are people who have published papers and in internationally peer-reviewed journals. These are people who have at least 20 years of teaching experience. They have come to India before, many of them, and they have taught in Indian schools. And what they say is that our students are as good, if not better, than the top 25% students that they have taught anywhere in the world. So, you need a business education. Competition is only going to increase. You need a business education that is global because globalization is going to increase. 
you need a business education which provides value for money. For these reasons, you must come to Myra. You must apply and hopefully you will get in. We don't just look at some scores on some admission tests. Sure, we value admission tests, we value their scoring, but we think there is more to being a manager than somebody who can, who's very good in doing math or is very good in quantitative analysis or is very good in reasoning or is very good in communications. There is much more to being a manager than all of these basic entry-level requirements. Yes, you should have a good CAT score or a good GMAT score or a good ZAT score or a good GRE score and you must know why the hell you want to be a manager. If That's why we place enormous importance on your statement of purpose. Why you want to do an MBA? You say, yes, I want to get a job. Very good. What kind of a job do you want? Have you thought about it? What do you want to do in addition to getting a job? Have you thought about being an entrepreneur? Have you thought about the underprivileged in society? Is there some way you can touch those folks as well through your work? If you have thought about these things, if you have a perspective, if you have a plan, look, come on over, take a look at us, visit our website, give us a call. You can call me, you can write to me, naga.kumar at myra.ac.in. Shoot me a mail and I'll get you a response. Or you write to our admissions folks. It's, the addresses are all given in our website. Go visit our website, check us out. Come, come over to Mysore. It's a lovely little city. I enjoy it enormously and I'm sure you will too. So I look forward to hearing from you. I look forward to meeting you in Mysore. I look forward to taking you around our school, the Myra School of Business. Uh, soon, uh, soon, we're going to, there is quite a rush for our seats. I hope you will join in and make that rush even more interesting and exciting. And if you come here, I promise you this, you will have the time of your life. Take care now. Bye-bye.